Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today, I'm gonna to be explaining why you might be seeing a $0 balance for your crypto buying power on Webull. So as you can see on Webull, I currently have a cash balance of over $300. However, at the very bottom, you see that my crypto buying power is zero. So I got this money because I did sell some stock and what I have to do in order to get crypto buying power is basically wait a few days because right now the money is just kind of sitting there. It's kind of in transit. It's just kind of waiting to actually hit your account. Once it is fully settled into your account, it will show up under crypto buying power as well. Right now I could trade stocks, but right now I just can't buy cryptocurrency with it. So let me just show you guys, like if I try buying some Dogecoin right now, so let's say I'm trying to buy $5 worth of Doge, you'll still see that my crypto buying power is zero dollars so let's see what happens if i hit buy understood confirm insufficient crypto buying power to place this order so yeah whether you're depositing money directly from your bank account to webull it will usually take i think anywhere from the range of like three to five business days for your funds to settle and then you can do whatever you want with the money whether it's buy more stocks or buy some cryptocurrency and this is just something they do to make sure you actually have the funds available because buying crypto on webull is still a fairly new process so they're just working out the details at this point but maybe in the future there'll be like instant access to your funds for the crypto buying power but until then all you have to do in order to gain your crypto buying power after you put money into your account is just wait a few days if this video helped you out be sure to hit that like button thank you guys for watching i'll see you guys later